Yo, what's poppin' everybody? My name is Andrew aka Shazam1435 and today I have an NBA 2K12 my player video of Andrew Kim playing against the Miami Heat, LeBron James, Dwayne Wade, Chris Bosh aka Raptor Head. <laughs> um, so we are in Miami, we are playing the Heat and uh, my computer is lagging like crazy. Anyways, um, I know last video I said that this video was gonna be a surprise. Well, it's because my next, well, this video was supposed to be a 112 point game I had, and LeBron just loves that poster, doesn't he? Um, a 112 point game I had against uh, the Sacramento Kings, actually, my former team. But uh, for some reason, I deleted that file, so. Yeah, I can't upload it anymore, but it was really cool. 112 points, and this shot by Dwayne Wade, I was just like, what? He switches hands and does all sorts of crazy stuff. But um, what I'm here to talk about today is, uh, the other day I was watching uh, 16 and Pregnant. Don't ask me why I was watching that, I was just bored. <laughs> and it was it was an interesting show I didn't finish it I watched about halfway and I'm like I can't watch this anymore so I turned it off but it was very interesting in the fact that these people are 16 they contact MTV and then they get a TV show maybe I should do that <laughs> and right here I go for the nasty slam to end, of, end the first quarter and this was actually a pretty close game uh, I'm not gonna lie uh, Usually, a, a lot of my my player games aren't very close at all, but this one was actually pretty close in the beginning, of course. But anyways, talking about sixteen and pregnant, uh, it was about this girl, and of course she got pregnant, and she lives in Reno, and then she's white, and her boyfriend's Mexican and or Latino. I can't automatically assume that he's Mexican, but he's Latino, and they were going on and off, and it was pretty interesting. Um, because she's like f five months in, and her her mom in the beginning wanted her to have an abortion, and it was really weird because um, when they showed the girl talking to her mom, she's like, "You don't understand me. Like, you forcing me to do this, you're pressuring me to do that." And like, and I was sitting there like, "Well, that's the natural thing to do. Like, you're 16. You should probably." not spend your life taking care of a baby I mean she was she had she was gonna be a cage fighter um, she was studying to become a detective so she had a lot of things going on and then her mom says maybe you should just abort the baby so you could keep continuing your life and then she's like oh my gosh you don't understand and blah 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 and you know it was very Oh, another thing, she was blonde too, so that may have been why. But it was very, uh, it was very frustrating to watch because it seems like some people don't understand what's right versus what's wrong. I mean, obviously, your mother's trying to help you out, so that's why. I mean, that's why she's saying all this. But I feel like teenage pregnancies are just really stupid. Um. Although I am Catholic and believe and should believe that every baby, no matter how young, uh, should have a decision and to say if they want to live, aka abortion. So that's why many Christians and Catholics are against it. But I feel that abortions are, are kind of necessary in, in order to A, control our human population, which is starting to get out of control. We have like over 7 billion people on this earth. But it's also to, you know, in situations like this, like teenagers should not have babies unless the the couple is committed. Because obviously this was a mistake. Um, <laughs> she was actually talking to friend, her friend, and she's like, "Well, we did it once without protection, and we didn't have, we I didn't get pregnant, so we tried it again, and well, now we got pregnant." And I'm like, "Well, no, duh." I mean. Um, someone didn't go to health class, but, you know, it's very, you, you kind of do need abortion in a way, because 
you know, not only in cases of rape and uh, sexual assault, but in cases like this, where it's a mis total mistake, and I think babies should only be born into a family that is willing to take care of them, because you don't even know if this, this woman wants to take care of this baby, and I don't know, it's just, I feel terrible, because, you know, like I said, you can't tell if the couple's ready to have a baby yet, or if they're willing, because taking care of a human being is very hard, um, especially like a little toddler. I mean, I can ba barely take care of like th three fish, so you know, it's gonna be very difficult for some people because you know, some people are like me and can't, you know, take care of many things. But to finish off, finish this off. Um, I also want to talk about like husbands leaving their wives, like especially in the teenage pregnancy thing. I think that's very stupid. That's really irresponsible. I mean, it is now both of your child, not just your wife's. So you shouldn't be leaving her. But that's pretty much all the time I have. Um, to summarize, don't get pregnant while you're a teenager. I'm, I'll try my hardest not to, you know, get a girl pregnant, and I hope I don't. But, um. I'll I'll have fun if you know what I mean. But uh, uh, the game is over. We be sit on the heat. I get player of the game, and uh, the pr the post game interview is gonna come up real soon. But I thank you guys for watching. My name is Andrew, aka Shazam135. Uh, thank you guys for watching this video, and I hope you guys have a nice day and a nice week and a nice month and a nice year. I'll talk to you guys later. Have a nice day. Peace out. One thing that really stood out tonight in the win was your defensive play. In particular, you had several steals. Can you talk about what you've done to improve that area of your game? Sure. Uh, it's pretty simple, really. A lot of time in the film room and a lot of extra work after practice. Coach came to me a while back and told me I really needed to improve my work on the defensive side of the ball to help this team win. And when Coach asked me something like that, I'm going to get it done, man. So... It's been a long time coming, but I really feel like all my hard work and efforts paying off. Man, I'm glad to hear you guys are seeing it too.